Hello, Clint. Mark here. If you want to see a real live alien being, be at Mindy's house at noon tomorrow. Be there or be square. Bye. <laughs> Where are you? I'm up here. I'll be right down. Where is he? Where is the alien? He's getting dressed. <laughs> what a day for mankind. What an event in the history of the universe. What a break for my career. <laughs> I can see it now. I'll be in Washington two years from now. The president, he'll call me. Clint, we need you. You're a good man. I am Mark from Mark, sent by my superiors to observe your primitive civilization and report back. Nanu, nanu. <laughs> you look like a reject from the OJs. <laughs> Mark, this is silly. I'm split, and this is ridiculous. Wait! How many people do you know that can drink with their finger? I'm sorry about this. I'll get back to you. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> How did you do that? <laughs> Greetings! I am Mindy Catwoman from Mars. <laughs> Mindy, what are you doing? I was sent here to observe your primitive planet. But that's my job. Listen, I'm the only alien here. I am Fred Zoll from Scherzo. Somehow I feel alienated. <laughs> I have been sent down here to observe your primitive society and demonstrate my great powers. Here, pick a card, any card. Clint, I don't know how to tell you this, but they're jiving your socks off. <laughs> Move aside, boys. Watch this. <laughs> you see that? Just a second. Hang on, now, just a second. There's a wire here. This whole thing is rigged. Oh. Well, Mark, he found us out. Sean's butt. <laughs> Look, I just want to say that uh, you're the most unconvincing group of aliens I have ever seen in my life, and uh, Mork, you are the worst. <laughs> the next time you try and impersonate an alien, why don't you just leave the pajamas home? I refuse to be made a fool of. Too late. It's a real spacesuit. I paid 50 trivets for this in New York. <laughs> now you'll never get the money you need for the store. Well, we won't get it from thinking on you. We've been down before, but we'll get out of it. Yeah, we always have before. Anyway, Mark, I don't want to lose you. And besides, I've grown accustomed to your... Uh... <laughs> Why did you do that when you needed the money so really badly? Oh, you don't understand. Work, you're more important than any amount of money. You can't buy friendship. So even if I turned myself in, it would have been for nothing. Oh, that's right. And you saved me from that? Well, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, 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 thank you